Hello class. Before we get started on our projects, I want to go over several very important aspects of the course. Drawing is a unique art form in that it often uses relatively common types of tools like pencils or pens that we use normally in our everyday life. We're accustomed to writing with pencils or taking notes with them. For this reason, there's a tendency for beginning drawing students to fall into the habit of using their drawing tools as if they were writing or taking notes. It's vital to make this distinction right away between writing and drawing. Drawing requires a totally different mode of holding a drawing tool and also a different way of holding your body while you use that tool. This is why for our large drawings, which are 18 by 24 inches, you'll want to have the paper propped up on a drawing board so that it is facing you. This will give you enough room so that you can comfortably extend your drawing arm fully. You want to have most movement come from the shoulder as opposed to the wrist. This allows your arm to have a full range of motion. In this video, I have a simple masonite board with my drawing pad clipped to it with office clamps and I propped up the drawing board on top of a trash can and propped it against the wall. Find a tabletop or piece of furniture that you can sit your drawing board on at home. Chafee College offers a first come first served rental kit for two or three dollars that includes a drawing board, paper clips, a steel ruler, a rubber cutting mat, and a few other very useful tools to have around your studio. At the end of the semester, you simply return it to the Chafee student store. This is different from the art supplies, which are sold separately. You can also look for any heavy bore you may have around your home that is large enough to place your large pad of paper against. Then all you will need are a couple of inexpensive office clips to hold it in place. If you prefer, you can also purchase a proper drawing board at your local art store that has clips already in the board probably for less than $20 or so.